Be on. Yeah. <laughs> so for making the CO2 carbon kit, Son of zinc man. oxide, you get a battery, dollar store, dollar twenty-five for two. Carbon zinc. That's what you yeah. want. Now you tape them, to open them up is a bit of a pain. It's got a sheet metal casing. You have to cut that. I used uh, some side cutters and, and a knife and you cut through. So that's garbage. And then you have your plastic coating here. Come closer, Mark. Show the battery. You cut off this plastic coating and here's your zinc. So that's all there is to it pretty much. Garbage. Yeah. So then you have a carbon rod in the center. Now that's a bit tricky to get out. Sometimes they break. So you grab it, don't squeeze it too hard. Let's see if I can do the device. Those There, see how easy they break. <laughs> so we have to dig that out. Let me get a screwdriver. Keep focused there, Mark. I am making a thing. So this is all full of it's a bit messy. If you're gonna do this inside. Uh, this way, yeah. No no, come on this side. I can. Yeah. It's full of uh Fill of carbon. So you dig it out with something. I'm using a screwdriver. As you can see, it's a messy. So the best thing is get a big newspaper if you're inside your house. Because this stuff will make your hands black. If you're okay, if you're okay with that. So I guess the best way is first dig it out before you try and pull out the carbon. There you go. So, there's your carbon rod. And this is your zinc. So, you have to clean this out really well. It has a piece of paper inside. So, you can see the paper. So, it insulates it from the uh, carbon rod. And that's that's a basic carbon zinc battery. Oh, no. That's how it works. So you got to remove all this stuff. You got to wash these really really good. After you clean this out. Got a paper on the bottom too. There it is. There. So, so it's all uh, insulated. So that's all emptied out now. There's your zinc. You can cut it open and flatten it out if you want. It's easier to wash. You just cut it with some snips or something. And then you drill a hole. So you can attach your wire and you can hang it. So that's what you need to make your CO2 GANs. If you put a dead battery, get a double uh, A is good, a dead battery, it's already used, not a new one. <coughs> you hook up your negative to your carbon, positive to your zinc, inside a 3.5% solution of salt, which is 35,000 parts per million. It's easy to work out if you're using liters. And there you go. Stop it. <laughs>